One of the best ways I've found to improve your shooting really doesn't even involve pulling the trigger. It's properly exiting and entering shooting positions. On today's pro tip, I'm going to show you some championship winning methods to improve your movement. Let's start by covering exiting shooting positions. There's two methods we'll use to exit a position based upon the difficulty of the target. If it's a hard or difficult target, I'll use a hard exit. For instance, if I was going to leave on this right popper here, I'm going to use a hard exit. In the case of the hard exit, you want to finish your shooting first and then leave the position. Now if you're moving from left to right, you want to pick up your right foot, pivot on your left foot, and drive off. The opposite would be true if you were going from right to left. But let's see it in real time going from left to right. With a hard exit, it's very important that you maintain a stable shooting platform until you've completed the shooting. Notice that my feet are not moving until I've broken the last shot. The second method to leaving a shooting position is the easy exit. I do this when I have a much larger target to fire my final shots on. With this method, I'm going to begin leaving as I fire my last shots from the position. With the easy exit method, I'm going to be firing my final shots as I leave the position. The way I'm going to do this is, I'm going to plant my right foot and cross over with my left foot. When using the easy exit, make sure that you fire your final shot before your foot touches down outside the box. Now that you've left the box, it's important that you run to the next position. You want to keep your gun up at the high ready when doing so for two reasons. One, it allows you to acquire the sights more quickly when you get to that next position. And number two, it allows you to negotiate any props that you may come across on your way there without sweeping your hand. Now if it's more than about three steps, I remove my weak hand from the gun and I use it to pump or drive my forward momentum. When you're running, don't overthink your footwork. It's just basic sprinting. Now that we've made the run over to the position, it's time to enter the box. You want to make sure that you slow your momentum before getting here. Next, you'll go ahead and plant your left foot outside the box, step in with your right foot while simultaneously pushing the pistol out to the target. Make one final step with your left foot, assuming a stable shooting platform. It's important that you keep your knees well bent to counter this forward momentum. One thing important to note about entering this box is, you're clear to engage the targets as soon as your foot leaves the ground. It doesn't necessarily have to be inside the box. Practice exiting, running to, and entering positions. They will save you valuable time. I personally save up to a half a second per position. Until next time, stay Army strong.